Hey, what's up folks? I uh, hope you and your family are doing well. As you already know, that shelter at home thing has been extended till the end of April. I'm also sure that you have been watching every single movie and every single series on Amazon Prime and Netflix. Uh, <laughs> I'm guilty of it. Uh, I'm probably up to like five or six movies a day. So, uh, I guess my point in saying this is you go through that many hours in the same position for five or six movies and, and without any movement. So I think when your body is just sitting in that same position for hours, uh, it goes through, through uh, what is it called, atrophy. What happened for, to me is uh, when I woke up this morning, my body didn't feel good. My muscles were tight, I was sore, I was groggy. I mean, I, I just didn't feel good. Okay, so what I did is I, I snuck up, uh, I snuck downstairs and stressed for about 20 to 30 minutes. After that, I, I felt really, really good. I could probably do another two to three <laughs> weeks. No, I can't. Um, so anyway, I thought I'd share this with you. Okay, so uh, hope this helps. Okay, folks, here's what we're gonna do. I want you to go ahead and have your feet shoulder width apart, toes pointing forward, body facing forward, put your hands on your hips. And all I want you to do is turn your head. We're gonna be looking left and right. So every two is one. Okay, so what we're gonna do is one, two, three. Okay, now we're gonna do the up and down. Just our chin and uh, to our chest and looking up. Okay, so we wanna go down, one, down, two, half circles. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna left, right, left, right. Don't do the full circle. Now, I want you to take your hand, I want you to put it flat on the top of your head, okay? Leave your other hand on your hip. Just lean in your ear into your shoulder. So your head is gonna be sideways, okay? And you're slightly gonna just give a little bit of a, a pull, not strong, okay? And I want you to rotate your head five times each direction, okay? So one, two, three. So if you're hearing any popping and, and grinding, that's actually a good thing. That means this is long overdue. All right, let's move on to our hands, okay? So what you're gonna do, act like you're gonna pray. Go ahead and put your hands together, all right? Then we're gonna start off with our fingers, all right? What you're gonna do is you're gonna keep one straight and then push on the other. Hold that there for about 10 seconds, okay? You're gonna put it right back up. And then you're gonna go for the other side. Push and let it bend it backwards. You can take one of them, let it, ooh, see here that pop? All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna pull, point our hand down and just palm and slightly push it in. Ooh, I heard another pop. And you're gonna push it in, not too hard, just enough to give it a good stretch on your on your wrist, okay? Do that for about 10 seconds. Now we're gonna interlace our fingers, okay? And we're just gonna go ahead and, go ahead and uh, whatever you do, like, a, you know, you know. But anyway, like this. Next, we're gonna do the shoulders, okay? All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go and swing one arm all the way across our body and swing our other one up to lock it in. So what I want you to do is I want you to pull that towards your chest. And if you really want to get a stretch, a, a two for one stretch, go ahead and turn into it. Oh, okay. Swing it out, do the other side, swing across your body, lock it in, make sure it's past your elbow, swing it back in. I always feel that swinging helps the, the momentum. It's easier to catch it, okay? Get it all the way to where you need it to be. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take that arm and swing that behind your head. You can take this one, swing it over and make sure your hand grabs your elbow because I want you to pull that elbow to the other side, to where your elbow, your the point of your elbow is almost to the center of your head. And you want to lean into that. Oh, yes. Go ahead and swing your arms outside and inside. Okay, and up and down. Okay. And that should be good. Okay, now we're going a little lower. Okay, we're working on our hips and our lower back. Okay, so well, this is kind of fun. Go ahead and leave your hands out. It's like the hula hoop kind of thing. Okay, so what I want you to do is I want you to swing to the left, swing to the right. Nothing hard. Swing to the left, almost like that Wonder Woman thing. Wonder Woman, you know. But so look at my feet, okay? They're going like this, they're switching, okay? So left and right and left and right. Okay, now what I want you to do is feet shoulder width apart. Go ahead and put your hands on your hips again. And some of you guys might think this is kind of funny because uh, you know, uh, you know, it's, it's your hip thrusting. Okay, why don't you rotate your or gyrate your hips? Okay, I want you to go ahead and get the full circle all the way forward, all the way out. Stick your butt out. Oh, there you go. And right now, I want you to make uh, widen your your stance a little bit, a little bit more than shoulder width apart. Okay. 
All right, so what I want you to do is I want you to lean forward, okay? Keep your back straight, all right? Keep your back straight. Lean forward and touch the floor with your fingertips, okay? Touch the floor. Right when you can do that, I want you to go ahead and take your one hand, grab your elbow. Take your other hand, grab your elbow. And all I want you to do is let it hang, okay? You should let it hang, and what you will feel, you'll feel like a little bit of pressure uh, on your back and your your uh, hands, okay? Now, close your stance to shoulder width apart. Do the same thing. This time, lean forward slowly, okay? And touch your toes, all right? Hold that for about a few seconds. Now, I want you to go ahead and grab your elbows again and lean in a little bit more. Now, I want you to come right back up and throw your hips a little bit forward, okay? Now, go ahead and put your feet together. All right, now for our legs, okay? All right, so I'm gonna scoot back a little bit just so you can see, every, well, not everything. I want you to make an L with your legs, okay? Take one foot, put it on the inside, and drag it all the way. To, so keep this one as straight as you can. Keep this one perpendicular. Try to pull on your toes, pull your whole body forward. Try to touch your head to your knees. If you can't re, uh, touch your toes, grab your calf. Okay, switch to the other side. Okay, one leg out. This is a really, really good stretch on your calf and your butt and your, your uh, hamstring. Right, next, I want you to take both feet, put them together, cup your toes, right, and then bring them in, okay? Bring them as far in as you can. Some people can't go all the way, that's fine. Just slightly, but, uh, what do you call it, bounce them, okay? And then on your last one, I want you to hold it there. Try to, try to get it all the way to the floor. Use your elbows to pin it down, okay? And lean forward. Uh, bring your, your foot out as far as you can. You're gonna take the other one all the way out there as far as you can. One hand, grab your, your foot. The other one, put your hand on your knee or across your, your shin and try to pull your, your head to your, to your knee. I want you to go to the center, all right? Now put your elbows on the floor. Okay, just put your hands in front of you just to stop you from crashing or face planting. Okay, so but still try to lean forward. You can, you're gonna feel it all right here. Okay, which is a really, really good stretch. Sorry, I had to readjust for the angle. Now, shoulder width apart. Okay, you stood up. Okay, once you take one side, take one step, now take another step. Okay, almost like you're, you're not doing the splits yet. You're still shoulder width apart. You're gonna keep the back leg straight and you're gonna bend the front knee, okay? As you're going to hug your knee, use your other hand to balance, okay? 30 seconds is good. All right, let's get one last uh, thing in there. You had a little bit more than a shoulder width apart, maybe a shoulder and a half, all right? Now I want you to do is go ahead and bend one side, okay? You're gonna bend this one and I want you to turn the other foot up. Pull yourself forward towards your, towards your uh, head to your knee, okay? You can do that for about 30 seconds. All right, folks, we are done. Uh, sorry that took a while, but hey, it's stretching, and stretching isn't meant to be rushed. Uh, stretching is actually like meditating, and when you meditate, uh, you clear your mind and your head of all the drama and the bullshit that we're dealing with on a day-to-day. -day. So hopefully this helped you because it definitely helped me. Be safe, be clean, be smart, and stay home while we get through this. Peace.